Cardinals. We're going to get to their game in just a minute, but man, we have a couple others to show you that are just awesome. Hit it. We're going to start things out with a little bit of Southwest Randolph versus Southern Guilford. And the Storm, they did just that. Rayshawn Knight with this 29-yard pass to Kenyon Taylor. And Taylor says, man, that was so easy. It's seven to zip at that point. Southern, then Rayshawn Knight gets the pass to Trey Wallace. And he takes this one on home. He says, because it's Friday, right? That's what we're supposed to do. But they don't stop. Nigel Thomas takes the handoff and pushes his way over the line. Oh, no, it's 20 to zip storm at that point. But this is the play of the night because this is Southern Guilford's Trey Wallace, who we've seen once, twice, make it three times as awesome. All the way down from the midfield to the touchdown, he gets it. Man, Southern Guilford goes on to win this one. It ain't pretty. 41 to zip. Oh, yeah. Then we've got a whole bunch of awesomeness with the East Wilkes Cardinals. And I'll tell you what, they came out against Starmouth tonight, and this game was just back and forth and all sorts of awesome. Let's go to those highlights before we get to all the other shenanigans. We start things out. Starmouth's ready for this one. They say, hey, East Wilkes, you're coming into our house. Andrew Smithers drops back, and then he says, uh, I'm just going to run it. 27 yards on in for the touchdown, and all of East Wilkes is looking at me right now like, bruh, we're here. Why are you showing Starmouth? It's seven zip for the Rams at first, but then East Bryce Bestel, a 34-yard touchdown pass to Jared Wood at his fingertips, just placing it like it's yesterday. 7-7 seven, seven at that point, and then Smithers. Oh, wow. 60-yard touchdown. Not so pretty if you're East Wilkes. It's 13-7, to seven, and they say, oh, no, is our undefeated season at risk? Nah, because Cayman Bryan. An eight-yard touchdown run makes it 14-13 to 13 Cardinals. And we're not done yet because in the third quarter, Mr. Bryce Bethel, who we're going to talk to in just a moment, he passes to Jared Wood, and Jared Wood gets it to the 10-yard line, and then East goes on to win this one. Check it, 28-21. to 21. Wow, what a win for this East Wilkes squad. You guys are still undefeated. I am joined now by the quarterback, Bryce Vestal. And Bryce, you guys had an incredible game tonight. It feels great just to end the streak. We haven't beat Star Mountain so long, it just feels great to finally beat them. And undefeated on the season, as the pressure mounts, what do you tell your team? We just got to stay focused and look to next week and beat Wilkes Central. Awesome. They're already looking ahead to next week. No time to celebrate this one, huh? Well, we got tonight. There we go. And sheer wine galore. Now, normally the quarterback, he does the Blaze Air, air conditioning and heating tire quarterback challenge. But he is press, passing it off tonight to Mr. Zach Sparks. So, Zach, you have the football. You have the spotlight. There's your goal. Hit it, my friend. It counts! Awesome, awesome, awesome. Zach Sparks ups the quarterback challenge just one more time. What an incredible night for East Wilkes. Congratulations to them, and thank you all for watching. Don't forget to hit up our Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, all on high school sports. High school playbook, I should say, and WXI Sports. Guys, it has been incredible. You actually go to, what is it, 9-0 and right now? 9-0 and East Wilkes. Undefeated still. Everybody said Star Mount had a chance in this one. They did, but you guys came on back. Congratulations to Bryce Vestal. Zach, my man, where are you? Get over here. What an incredible slam dunk. It's the first slam dunk of the season. Thank you for watching. I'm going to let him hoot and holler a bit. Go for it.